All right, guys, I just want to show you what I carry when I'm out on a day hike or something like that. Granted, this will be like on marked trails and stuff, and this is not meant to be a video of a real backpacking kind of trip kind of thing. This is just like a regular walk in a park or something like that or on a local nature reserve or a conservation district or something like that. And um, so it's not meant to be the big broader kind of thing that you'd bring on a longer trip or something but I just carried this kind of stuff uh, in a backpack you saw I bought an, uh, I had bought the new uh, outdoor products bag I used to have a, a North Face one which uh, served me well for many years still have it still love it but I just wanted to do something different so um, let me show you what I uh, usually bring with me on just uh, like I said a regular light kind of walk in the woods all right, so obviously you got the pack. I like to have uh, my hat. Oh, this hat's been with me for decades. And uh, I like to have a reflective vest too. It's one of those like workman's, uh, you know, road worker vests and stuff like that. It's good if you, uh, you know, get totally lost. You can wear it and signal or something like that. But it's visible, something with visibility. Um, an armor poncho. It's good for, yeah, you guys know. Uh, basic little cooking kit. It's got um, like a cup in there and uh, something to boil water with and what have you. Uh, some rope. I bought this little uh, Bear Grylls survival kind of kit. I'll make an overview of that soon here. Of course, the uh, canteen, which I just bought too. Uh, but I used to have one of those uh, old army canteens, and that worked well too. I just want to do, sometimes you just got to do something different, right? Uh, and of course, always a, a knife, and um, just a complete MRE meal kit. Um, I don't know, just to have one, just in case. Not like uh, you really get lost, but you know, you, you never know. You, you could always hit your head on a branch or something and wake up unconscious well actually you wouldn't be waking up unconscious would you no you'd be waking up after being unconscious and you forget where you are well, at least you could eat something <laughs> um yeah and the um the survival kit thing uh like i said i'll, I'll do a more in-depth thing in there but uh, it has like matches in there and a uh, fire uh, steel or something like that so just a way to start fires my personal thing is, if you're just going to go out and do stuff, um, just bring lighters and matches. Because fire steels are really cool and stuff like that, but if you really have to start a fire, uh, it can be real hassle and matches and a lighter. <laughs> they work if you plan ahead. So, yeah, that was just a basic uh, video of what's in a regular uh, little day pack for me uh, when I'm out in the woods. Or in a park. <laughs> All right. Later.